Hi guys, this is Molly, and my iPad came back, and I downloaded some more things off of Cydia, like, um, themes and that, and I'm just going to show you what ones I got, what they're called, and if you like them, how you can get them. So once you have your iPod jailbroken, you can just go to Cydia, and you can download all these different apps and backgrounds that you like, and then once you want to apply them, like I don't have anything replied right now, this is just the regular background, you go to Winterboard, and then down here you'll see this thing that says select themes, and you click it, then all these themes, or the ones that you downloaded would come up, and like the ones that you have, they'll have little check marks by it. And one of my themes I have is and then the best Justin Bieber theme. I don't really see it, but it's right here. Best Justin Bieber theme. And in my last video, I already showed you what that looked like. And then those are just things like for the colors. And one of my things I have is called Alice in Wonderland. There's a bunch. And this is what it looks like. The background is the cat, and like it doesn't have a thing down here, so it's like invisible. But you can still kind of see it. And when you go in, you see the background. And that's what that one looks like. And then I have a bunch of Hello Kitty themes. I have one, two, three, I have four. And this, like some of them, they just have like the background, where they just have the background and like the flat screens. But you can also, if you go to themes, you can press like full, and it will like customize everything. like what your battery bar looks like, what your apps look like. Like I have this Hello Kitty one and like down there it says by Hello Kitty. And I have one where the apps are like different. Like this one, this is one of the ones where the apps are different. Like the app store and music, like not music and videos, but like these. Like that's the background and like it changes what the pictures look like to where they're like Hello Kitty. I think that one's really cute and then but it doesn't have a background. Like this background, this one's personally mine that I put on there. So whatever your background would be, that's what it would be. And then this. I think it's pretty cute. And that one was just called Hello Kitty, but there's like a lot of Hello Kitties. But you're just going to have to probably download a few to see what one that one is. And then my other one I have, I don't remember what this one looks like, but I think it's somewhat similar to this. But I think it just has like different colored pictures or different pictures of what they look like. Okay, it says slide to unlock, but in different color because of my color. Yeah, this has the same background, but the pictures are just different. So really, I don't think it matters which one you would get. It just depends on what picture you'd like. And then I have another one called Hello Kitty Theme. That's what it's called, Hello Kitty Theme. And this is what it looks like. Hold on. And this one isn't, like, as colorful. Like, it just has that for the front, and then I think it's the same for the back. Yeah with the regular app color so if you like something plain Hello Kitty theme I think you'd like that maybe or whatever you like and then I have another one just called Hello Kitty and this is what this one looks like and like the background you have to like apply your own background or get a background off of a different um the that Hello Kitty theme just has a front and then the next one I have is called my Japanese theme Right there, and that's what it's called, My Jap Japanese Theme. That's all you would search. I don't know if there's more than one, but that's the one I found. And so I'll show you what it looks like. And the background's a tree, and the little arrow is, like, pointy. And down there, I can't really read it, because it's, like, in Japanese. That's what it looks like. And then the apps are all, like, different. They're, like, kind of stone, and then the background's, like, a little checkerboard thing. I think it's kind of cute. And then the rest of them, I think, are maybe full apps. I have a few that aren't. Like, I have the Mac, okay. Like, I have a theme on here called MacBook 3.1 Final. And it kind of turns your iPad to, like, a background and the theme, like, the apps look like a MacBook. So I'll show you what it looks like when it loads. That's what it looks like. <clears throat> like the music and... That stay the same, but the rest turn all like my Mac key. And then you get to choose your like lock screen. This just changes the back and the apps. I also have one called the iDroid theme. So 
what it looks like. I draw you theme. Um, another one I think is cute. It's called the Hungry Caterpillar. I think it's pretty cute. And like all the like this is I think a f this is a full one. It changes your font, your apps, your background, and maybe your music. I'm not sure, but I have one up here that changes your music. It changes it like all red. And um, like it's cute. And it has a little caterpillar for the slider. And it says hungry. It's so cute. And see the little food and the caterpillar. And yeah, it's loading. I think it's cute. Yeah, and then it turns your clock red. I think it's pretty cute. And that was called Hungry Caterpillar. And then one else I have, I have a few Alice in Wonderlands, but those aren't really one. And then the one that has a full thing that you can buy a fold. And when you download it, it comes with like five different things. Like, I got the Aura Red V2, I don't know what it's called, but I click it. Then you add all the mod, tap to enter, and then you choose like a wallpaper or whatever. But I already chose one, so you'd have one. Four. Then you go back, and then you exit and then load. And it's like all red. And your music and that, like it'll be red, and when you turn it to the side, it'll be red, and it kind of turns it red. Like, I didn't really know what it was. I just kind of got it. And all this stuff on here is free. Like, no, nothing on here I had to buy. Like, see, and you close it. You just click it. It enters. You can see the background. Like, it, it does your apps different. And, like, your music. Like, to jailbreak it, it's free. All this stuff. And if, like, it gets messed up. Yeah, see, it's red. You can just, like, redo it. And it'll, like reset it on your iPod or whatever and it'll be like fine so yeah and then another one I think like one or two left um yeah I have a Windows 7 and it's like a computer theme like just Windows 7 I think that's what it's called Windows 7 and I think that changes like a lot of stuff. And this is my last one I'm gonna show because like the rest of them, I don't really think they're that you know cool. But there's probably other ones, but I just kind of jailbroke it recently. And these are just kind of ones I have. And I'm gonna put me. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. We'll see. It looks like that. Windows Seven Ultimate. When you enter it, it's like you're going into a computer. Like, this is the exact sound my computer makes. It's like you're going to do a computer, and that's what your iPod's like. And, like, it's loading. <coughs> Ugh. It's sick. Okay, I need to go. But that's it's kind of what I have for my jailbreak thing. And if you have any questions on how to jailbreak it, it's pretty easy. Just message me, and I'll like, tell you. And if you have any questions or comments or anything, just message me and I'll be happy to ask them. Or if you have a question about this, I'll just do it. Okay, thanks. Thanks for watching. Bye.